everybody. We got something new. Yep. I went and got myself some... A ba a little, a little. Kind of a big rig. You know. This is the Cross GC4. It's got all metal two-speed transmission, all metal axles. Uh, where's this? This side. So here's what we got. All this stuff here. Nice body. Metal or er, metal axles, metal rims and tires. Like all metal chassis. Again, the body's awesome. Back bed. Two speed metal transmissions. Metal axles, metal drive shafts. There's a nice shot of the trans. You know, really, really cool truck. There's the truck itself. So you can see what it would kind of look like when it's done. Yeah. So. Manual, of course. Little cross sticker set. Um, styrofoam. Always need styrofoam. Um, I guess axles. Pull an axle out here. Here's an axle. Look at that. How nice is that axle? Offset. All metal. Sounds just awesome. All metal gears inside. Uh, so that's like big metal axles are back in the house here's these ones here actually has universals in it which is awesome but again you know all metal C hubs and everything offset as well again so you know just an amazing looking axle pretty excited to uh, run these and I believe these are actually you can bolt these directly into an SCX 10 from what I've put together uh, here's a parts bag so from the looks of it we've got you know shocks um, drive shaft pieces some metal uh, skid plate stuff, some other things, light kit, that's cool. Um, this is a big part bag, but this, from the looks of it, this is all like uh, your body pieces, link ends, uh, light cups. Lots of like interior pieces, all like the you know the canisters and stuff like that. I believe one can actually be for your receiver, maybe. Um, so that'd be kind of cool. Uh, ooh, tires. So here's the tires. Beadlock metal beadlock rims. There's the hub there. Um, really nice really nice and as you know as well here's the tires pretty nice all-terrain tires um, probably going to put these on there we'll probably run some Mickey Thompson Baja claws as an upgrade bigger tires are always good I would say you guys agree these are big tires, but yeah, we could probably use some bigger tires. Here's the trans. So let's pull this this baby out. Pretty excited to see this. Look at that block. Boom. That thing is awesome. Just a massive massive transmission two speed uh, what kind of motor do we got here 
across this is a 45 turn so perfect perfect size motor um, gonna be able to tow the truggy you know whatever truck I'm out with gonna have the power so that's right on that like so far cross amazing this is amazing stuff uh, here of course we've got like the bed uh, the side panels and stuff like that so that's pretty cool um, like I'm thinking that's like the bed your wheels and everything like that so gonna have a flat deck which is cool might even be able to uh, I don't think the truck will fit on here, but a trailer will be able to be hooked up, I'm sure. Here is the chassis. Quite the nice chassis. Um, still sealed in there. I'd like to keep it like that for now. But, you know, big, nice, straight chassis for what it is. Because this is like a big rig, so you need big rig type uh, type gear, I would say, wouldn't you? You don't want just dinky little anything. And then the PA de resistance. Here is the body. So again, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, I think it sits about right there, ish. Ah, screw it. So there's the cab. I'm not sure what color I'm going to paint it yet. Might do like a red, like a dark blood red or something. I seem to like doing that with a lot of the trucks lately. Here's the interior. So I may as well say now. Probably going to have head duck in there. Um, possibly something else, I don't know, but probably put the duck in there just because it's the duck. And, uh, yeah. So this is the build that will start as soon as the truck is done. Which, in all honesty, should be within the next couple weeks, if that. Um, just got to get some glue to deal with last little bits and pieces. Um, you know, like I say, it's, there's not a lot left, so it's a matter of just getting the last bits and pieces together and going from there. All right, get quiet on you guys. I'm gonna just get this all nicely set in there, ish. <sighs> all right. Oh, this would be a good idea to put the chassis back in there. So that's 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 the truck. That is my first brand new truck unboxing. Come on, get in there. There we go. There we go. Boom. Cross GC4, one tenth scale. Pretty excited. First full size truck kind of thing. Let me know what you guys think in the description. Next video is going to be the overall finished product of the Truggy. Possibly a run with the uh, Torment as well. Uh, if I can get that up and going maybe tomorrow. Other than that, I hope everyone's having a great week. And plus it's the weekend now, so hope everyone has a great weekend. I don't think I've sworn once in this video, so everybody get your fucking trucks out and have a good fucking time. Yeah. Other than that, I'm going to get back with the truggy, get that finished, 
so that I can get on the new toy. Pretty excited, guys. Pretty excited. So again, cheers. Happy trailing. Hope everyone has a great weekend.